Hi guys, welcome back to the Scan Tool Network. In this video, we're going to be looking at the best diagnostic scan tools and scanners for Nissan and Subaru vehicles in 2021 and 2022. And at the end of the video, I'll tell you which of these tools I would personally recommend given my 15 years experience in the field. Now, I'm going to put links to all of these kits in the description below and in the pinned comment section. So please follow those links as they will take you to genuine and official products. Unfortunately, fakes and clones do exist and they can cause damage to your vehicle. So be very careful, follow the links provided. Now I'm going to be starting with the cheapest and working my way up to the most expensive. The most expensive kit generally will give you the most functionality and the most features, that's to be expected. But it doesn't necessarily mean you have to go for that to get the tool that you need. You know, this tool here, the cheapest tool, may well serve your needs just as well. But it all really depends on your specific requirements, what you're looking to get out of a tool and what sort of vehicle um, and system coverage you're looking at against your specific budget. So starting with this tool here, it's the ICOS of NS version 1.0 kit. This kit replaces the outgoing I903 kit and um, it covers all of the main systems in your vehicle. So for example, the engines, the airbags, the ABS and the transmission, it will cover those systems plus a few additional systems as well. It is classed as an all system scanner, but it all really depends on what, vehicle, what systems are installed into your vehicle. Um, as to whether they will work or not. But assume it's gonna cover the engines, airbags, ABS and transmission, and it will also do oil service resets as well. So if you've got a service message or a maintenance message that you need to reset, this tool will be fine for those needs. If that's all you need to get out of a tool, if that's all you need, then by all means, you, know, you don't need to go any further. This is the perfect tool for you. Uh, if you do want to get a bit more functionality, then the next step up is called the iCarsoft JP version 2.0. Now this doesn't just cover Nissan and Subaru, but it covers all Japanese vehicles. So it'll cover the likes of Toyota, Isuzu, Lexus. It'll also cover uh, Honda, Mitsubishi, Mazda. I probably missed a few others off there as well, but it covers all Japanese models. But not only that, it has more service functions. So when we talk about service functions, this one will only do the oil service reset. This will also do the oil service reset. In fact, it does everything that this kit will do, but it also does additional functions like electronic park and brake, DPF filter, uh, reset and regeneration, injector coding, ABS brake bleeding, electronic throttle reset, steering angle sensor, and new battery registration. It is, however, important for me to point out that the functions that I've just mentioned won't necessarily work on all vehicles. So for that reason, I've put the email address for Diagnostic World in the description below this video. If you need clarification on whether a specific function is suitable for your specific vehicle, then please use that email address. Also include your VIN number to make uh, the process a bit quicker and they'll double check for you. We then move on to the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. This kit does everything that these kits will do, so it carries across all of the functionality, all of the vehicle coverage, but it also adds additional manufacturer coverage. So whereas these only cover Asian models, this will cover the European sector, so the likes of BMW, Audi, Seat, Skoda, VW, um, Porsche, Mercedes, Ford, European Ford, Vauxhall. Uh, there's probably quite a few I've missed off there, but it covers all of those. Um, it does the Korean market as well and the American market. So the likes of uh, Chrysler, Chevrolet, American Ford, Jeep, Dodge, um, GMC, Hummer, those kind of um, those kind of models. So um, this, as I say, it covers all of the functions of these, but covers all uh, regions worldwide. And then we move on to the Autel MK808. This is the most expensive tool on the table, but it is the best. It's probably just under double the price of this tool, but it offers a lot more in the way of service functionality. So these tools only offer like nine service functions. Well, these two do. This one only one. This offers 25. So this covers everything that these teal tools will do, but it also does additional um, functions like um, key, I think it's key coding, um, Immobilizer, it does gear learning, it does suspension calibration, it does adaptions. So it really is probably more geared towards a, a mobile mechanic 
um, small garage or small workshop. But you know, if you are a DIY and you do want to jump straight into the deep end, then this tool is perfectly usable for you. It's very easy to use, and there's very little you know learning that you need to do on, on a tool like this. It all really depends on your budget, though. You know, if you've got a low budget and all you need to do is reset an airbag light, then there's no problem with going for this kit here. This kit will do the job just as well for you. Um, so when it comes to what I would personally recommend for a tool, given my experience, I would always be looking for a tool that offers the best value for money. And when I say value for money, I'd be looking at um, the vehicle coverage, the system coverage within those vehicles and the service functionality. And I feel the best value for money tool that does that on the market right now is this one here. It's the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. And this will basically serve all of your needs no matter what car you've got in the family. Unless you've got a supercar, then it won't cover those. But um, general, most of the mainstream cars, it will cover those vehicles, all of the systems within those vehicles. And this is certainly what I would recommend. But it all depends, as I say, on your specific budget, your requirements, and your specific vehicle needs. Now remember, I'm putting links to all of these kits in the description below this video. Make sure you use those links because they will take you to the genuine and the official products. Be aware of fakes, that's all I'm saying. The email address is also in the description there if you need to contact Diagnostic World to make sure any of these tools are suitable. Thanks for watching the video. If it's been useful for you or it's helped you in any way, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and we'll be back very soon with more videos on the ScanTool Network.